Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Salallahu alaihi wasallam. Tohid again with you guys. Uh, let me show you today what uh, topic we are going to cover. The today's topic is Grails Bismillah with Intel ID. Uh, first of all, we are roam around the Grails official website and then download the Grails SDK. Then we will create a Bismillah project. Okay, l let me start. Uh, this is the Grails official uh, website. This is, this is uh, Grails.org. Uh, here you are seeing the uh, uh, various uh, information about Grails, uh, uh, documentation and uh, download information and plugins, uh, uh, guidance, support, FAQ, community also uh, uh, SARS, learning things. L let me uh, show you uh, the uh, documentation section okay this is uh, basically a documentation section here uh, you are seeing uh, this is very useful to me uh, every time when i came here and uh, a source for uh, help but then it it helped me very much here you are seeing uh, various topic uh, here and there okay uh, now I am going to uh, show you the uh, basically installation uh, process of uh, Grails. Uh, this is the basically Grails installation process. Uh, uh, here you are seeing using the SDK man, and uh, there are very other process you can uh, follow for uh, installation <coughs> Grails or start Grails. Uh, uh, let me show you the learning thing or something where I get the uh, actually a tutorial uh, this is some of uh, uh, Grails uh, practical books you are seeing in this section and then uh, let me find out the some useful tutorial I just uh, visited here okay uh, in this section I am going to download uh, the uh, Grails SDK. Uh, uh, just now I heard that uh, in font section you are seeing that the release version is 3.3.6 but I uh, just not hear that uh, Grails released their uh, latest version 3.3.8. Uh, this is not uh, showing here but uh, uh, they have uh, git repository also. This is the uh, basically the Grails repository here you can uh, you can find the latest versions of Grails release and other thing. Uh, this is uh, this is the uh, latest version Grails uh, 3.3.8. Uh, this is uh, released uh, 23 hours ago. I am very lucky before create I this uh, tutorial I am get this uh, and latest version which is uh, released by Grammy Richer. Uh, Roger, sorry, he is the uh, owner of uh, or founder of or uh, father of Grails basically uh, he is he is a fantastic man and uh, let me uh, download the uh, Grails function I am clicking on uh, this uh, download button and it will start uh, to Grails download uh, but uh, it will take that uh, 10 to 20 minutes because of uh, my internet speed is very slow that's why I cancelling it I already downloaded uh, that uh, at that Grails SDK uh, into my uh, PC. Actually, I downloaded that and extract the zip uh, file. Uh, this is uh, uh, basically stored in. I, I forgot the location actually. Uh, let me find out. Actually, this is Grails, Grails, somewhere in Grails. This is Grails, and I downloaded the Grails. Uh, 338 and it extracted it this is the basically uh, grails uh, sources okay now i'm going to uh, create a project create a bismillah project uh, using intelis ide uh, this is my intelis ide uh, here i'm going to create a new project i'm clicking on file then new going to project here you are seeing uh, various uh, project types in left panel but uh, we are uh, for the time being we are uh, going to create the Grails project I am selecting on Grails then this is the Grails SDK oh, I already browse my uh, Grails 3.3.8 and uh, set up here and uh, my Java version is 1.8 now I am going to 
uh, press on next yep uh, it will asking for project name and the location uh, I am giving the project name is grills bismillah ok done now I am going to press on finish uh, it is asking for I will use this window or new window uh, for this case I am using this window uh, it started to create a Grails application here you are seeing uh, just a one file that is dot IDE uh, after completing its task it will populate the whole directory structure I hope yep it uh, did now uh, this is the Grails uh, whole structure here you are seeing the under the grails directory you will find the most of thing about grails this is the controllers domain initialization services taglib utils views and uh, uh, assets here you will store images javascript css this is the configuration file uh, here you can specify your database configuration your uh, port number in development mode and some of other configuration seems uh, yep it's a completed uh, a installation process uh, let me uh, run the project okay in this case here uh, you are seeing the uh, two panel I you can uh, run this application as run mode and debug mode if you not see this uh, panel uh, then let me show you how you visible them Uh, sometimes uh, Intel is idea like this uh, so if you want to enable the control panels uh, so go to view click on toolbar then it will show the toolbars and uh, you can uh, uh, visible the other options I am clicking and visibling one after another okay this is the actually all about uh, uh, information about Intel is idea so now I am clicking on uh, a debug button then it will show the process how it going to run the IntelliJ IDE application in this case I am uh, actually uh, working constantly in Grails that's why the resolving process uh, uh, seeing here very uh, short but it could be uh, time consuming because it uh, downloaded all of dependencies from a remote server so don't worry about that uh, if the project is take time for start it's uh, it's okay okay now we are waiting for uh, grails start it will start within uh, 30 second i hope Uh, sometimes it asks for uh, Gradle uh, project need to be incorporated please uh, click on uh, import changes okay it automatically uh, start uh, and uh, open browser and uh, 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 go to the Grails uh, basic state but uh, here you can see the URL and, and the environment is development this is the uh, Grails uh, basic application uh, uh, when you create a, a Grails basic application the you will get this uh, screen this is the artifacts install plugin and this is the basic UI okay guys uh, hope you uh, can create the Grails project in uh, beginning so we will uh, learn many more things uh, for our uh, next uh, tutorials uh, thank you guys for watching uh, if you think the video is helpful to you then please don't forget to subscribe my channel because I always and every time love to share my knowledge to other people thank you thank you so much